In the brief time that I have left with you, I'd like to share my opinion on TikTok. It is receiving support from both political parties in this country because the Chinese are gathering user data for purposes that are unknown, but listen, technology can be riskier than most people realize. I worry about the children who are growing up in this app-driven world because I can actually recall a time when not everyone had a cell phone and there wasn't a computer in every home. I believe that the government is moving in the right direction with this, but I hope that more people would see the logic behind it and make their own better educated decisions. I never joined TikTok and I never installed it on my phone. It reminds me of when Mike Bloomberg tried to ban large sodas in New York City. His heart was in the right place, sugar is unhealthy, it causes disease, it makes us obese. But at that time, I remember thinking wouldn't it be better if we taught kids why sodas aren't healthy and then the ban was enacted. I don't want my data. Being collected by ByteDance, that's the company that owns it. I'm not happy that Google, Amazon, Facebook, and other I also wish that these youngsters can be taught to live in the moment and to socialize in person more instead of hiding behind the screen since what they see on these displays and on their phones isn't necessarily true. I have one more thing to say to you. Friday won't be permitted to post on TikTok, but occasionally you might see her on my Instagram, and she won't be permitted to shout orders at Alexa, which I'm quite sure will be to her benefit as I remember those days and they were really wonderful. If you loved the video please hit a like button and don't forget to subscribe the channel.